Hi, Lori Popow here. I've come back from the fourth annual Pisanki at the Gardens, where we recorded several demonstrations from various egg artists. Because these were live events, the audio and video aren't studio quality, but I know you will still enjoy them very much. And you want to do an exact centered thing with this thing. All you have to do is line up the marks right there. Draw your circle. Oh. And then, if you want an outer circle, you do the same thing. Friend? And it takes no effort whatsoever. And then, if you don't have an exact measurement around, in other words, if they're going to be a little bit too much, then it takes absolutely nothing to just enlarge each one a little bit if you want them to touch, or if you want space in between, you can adjust them infinitely because once you have those lines, it's easy to have them. But I work with the, I carry these with me every place. And it makes, it's so simple. Plus then if you know what that measurement is, you can even use these to measure around an egg or this one. This one is an inch and a bit. This one is about seven eighths of an inch. Um, this one I don't know. But you can't hold it, so I stuck the push pin in it. But that is a perfectly machined circle. So it is absolutely easy to draw a perfect tiny little circle. And then when you draw the circle, like this, then you mark where these are. And then you can extend those lines out and you have a perfectly sectioned circle from your center point. And it takes all of the guesswork out of it. I'm, I'm not an artist, I'm practical. <laughs> and, and it makes something that would, all the measuring and the onerous difficulty, it makes it really easy so you don't have to worry about that. And even someone who has trouble drawing a straight line can do something like this very easily. So it is just a dead simple way to draw perfect circles. So make sure you get your freebies here. <laughs> Any questions? You, would you, you just mark this with like a Sharpie or something? It has to be permanent, yeah, a Sharpie. Yeah, yeah. If you use something like a ballpoint pen or something like that. Yeah. 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 Uh, and I mark sixths and eighths yeah. in, 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 in different colors. colors. Yeah. In different colors. And if you right. didn't bring your Sharpies, yeah. Fran's got a whole set of different colors. Oh. So do I. Okay. I have one, but it's a fat, fat tip. You want a, a fine tip? Never mind. I think mine is. So never mind. But if I will leave this on my workstation there, and if you want to, can you just just come and grab it, and you can use it. Thank you. And then fix it up. Thank you. All right. Thanks for watching my videos. Please subscribe to my channel to get updates of new videos. Visit my website at loripopal.com. Hugs!